Hey there, it's J-Dog. Hey, today I'm in the little village of Shelburne Falls, Massachusetts to visit the Bridge of Flowers. Shelburne Falls is in the western part of Massachusetts. I'll put up a little map here so you can see where I am. It sits right along the Deerfield River. And I'll show you a clip of the falls so you can see what it's uh, named for there. That's the namesake, Shelburne Falls. But it's also claimed to fame as having this uh, famous bridge that's covered with flowers. I was here last summer in uh, 2020, and I was out on the, my uh, little road trip out to the Berkshire Mountains. And I'll put up a little uh, a link so you can see that video. And I stopped here because I wanted to see the Bridge of Flowers. But it was closed because of COVID. So this year, I'm going back out to the Berkshires, and, uh, but I stopped here because I, I looked and the bridge is open. So what I wanted to do is really do a little video of uh, the Bridge of Flowers and the little village of Shelburne Falls because I thought that would be neat for people to see. I just walked over the bridge across the Deerfield River. The town on the other side is called Buckland. It's a small little thing, a little intersection. But let me show you the village of Shelburne Falls. It's right behind me here. Uh, no, it's pretty. A little, it's just a small little village. Uh, it's pretty little funky buildings here on each side of the road, uh, with some uh, little artisan shops and stuff. But it's a, it's a nice little place to visit. So Shelburne Falls is a nice little village to visit. Uh, but its claim to fame is this bridge behind me, which is the Bridge of Flowers. That bridge is an old uh, trolley car bridge. It was an old uh, train trolley uh, bridge that uh, was built in the early 1900s. And I don't know when it closed, but eventually uh, they built that new iron bridge, which you can see over there. And uh, this eventually got turned into kind of a living flower garden. So the bridge is sort of famous. People come from all over the country to see this bridge. I wish it was a better day to film because the colors would really pop. But I thought what I'd do today is just really show you a whole bunch of little quick clips and some stills as I walk across the bridge and put some background music so you can just kind of enjoy the Bridge of Flowers. Well, that was pretty spectacular. Boy, those flowers, if the sun was out, those colors would have been spectacular. But uh, I hope you enjoyed the video. When my wife sees this, she's going to make me take her out here. And it's not that far from our house. It's about an hour and a half drive. But uh, no, this is pretty good. If you're out in the western part of Massachusetts, out on Route 2, definitely recommend you stop at Shelburne Falls to see the Bridge of Flowers. Stay safe. See you on down the road.